Well, tonight is an exceptional night. I have been back to work the past few days. There's been some things I've been kind of sharing with my close friends over Messenger. Not a lot I have time to say right now. I'll be getting ready to go out in a little bit. That's kind of why I've got my Mammoth Tusk Cross on and my high school ring, the couple things I wear when I go out to places. So, but I just wanted to come on here and tell you all that I've got a little bit more to show you as to how Mary is carved to this nativity set. And there will come a time when we will get around to showing you the first video to carving Joseph. But one thing I will tell you is that these are the ones that are going to be Joseph. And as you can see, there's a step I've already taken, which is quite similar to a step in carving Mary. They tell you in the book to refer to a certain chapter and a certain figure just to kind of get the ideal, what it's supposed to be, how it's supposed to be. So that's kind of what you follow just to kind of get along for instructions. So I just kind of thought since that's how the book tells it to you, I'd demonstrate it the same way. But now we're just going to do a little thing. We are going to carve the part in the front of Mary, which is the part her fate of the wood her face is going to be carved into. And if you notice how the shoulder line is here, it's kind of up a little bit. There's the place where you make the stop cut is a little up there like that. So we've kind of got a little place to make there. So we're going to work that in a little bit. Take care of that little stuff. And as you can see, we're coming along on this old fine. Is going to be the kind of work that's going to take itself to the new world, the new level. We've kind of got a lot to take with this, a lot of ways to go. And that's how we're going to take this along. The work that comes the way it does about these projects. I say that this little time of mine, we got a little place to go. Tell you a little bit more about work. I'd say the way it was on Monday, we had a district-wide meeting out at Rupp Arena. It was pretty crowded in there. It was pretty noisy. I kind of just got really stressed out and dozed out from all the noise. We got back on the bus and headed back to our school where I finally signed the paper to get out of work and head on home. Went back on Tuesday to kind of do a little cleanup in the morning and kind of like to put stuff away in the freezer. I got my new job this year in the dish room. Finally got to where my manager was nice and she just said, you know, I trust you with it. I have faith in you. You can do it. It's kind of like the thing we just kind of see all this stuff about the Bible where it says, whoever is trusted with very little will also be trusted with very much. And whoever is dishonest with very little will also be dishonest with very much. We know it's kind of an easier task for me. I'm not out there just kind of having to stop every which way to get every this and that. And we're thankful and hoping that we're going to be able to keep the help we've received this year. We have received a little bit more help than we had last year. We're sure everybody's going to act a little better this year than they did last year. There have been a little few differences taking place because principal's been making some announcements during lunch to the kids. They have new rules and everything. I've been hearing a little stuff about how they're kind of enforcing a better dress code this year. I tell you, it's just the kind of thing where 
for all the things going on these days. There's just a whole lot more that we need just to kind of, you know, just to kind of help kids get a little more guidance and have a little better understanding, a little better training, because that's what the world needs. I do want to say that this is where I've come along on this. I say, with this little Virgin Mary here, I've kind of gotten to wear with this part of the front here. We got that much out, and where you see this line's been drawn, that's where we carve along to get rid of the rest. Sometimes there's been a few exceptions and differences in how I've had to carve in places. Sometimes I get up and do it first thing in the morning before work, depending on what I need to work on, depending on what it is. Might kind of even do it over in my cozier corner and instead of in this shop. So sometimes I've had to kind of take little light strokes of the knife just to make little chips and so that they wouldn't be flying everywhere and cut creating a lot of messes so we kind of i'd say this is all under our control we got all this together and taking things to the level where things need to be i'd like to say that this little works come along right on here and there's just one little thing I need to say about this. The video might be a little shorter this time because there's probably a little less to share, a little less to say, a little less to go about. But I'd say as far as the work is coming along, it's getting along just fine, making its way to us. And... We've got the work here in our hands. There's been a lot to see online, a lot to see on Etsy. There's been things I've been ordering for my shop. If you've been on my pages, you've kind of seen that I've made some pumpkins. I've made some black cats that I've taken pictures of, but haven't posted them yet. They have painted paws and painted whiskers. Unlike some other cats I've done in the past, they been kind of designed a little more for Halloween. I've made some little ghosts out of lighter colors of denim. So you'll see that there's a little more work that's been coming along lately as far as how things go. I'll have a little more to share later on. But as for the step we just did, I will say that maybe the next time around we're going to talk about Joseph, but you will notice he has a little bit of a lower shoulder line, so that's one of the things we're going to work on. But I come to say that at this time, for the time of night it is, and for the way I kind of like to go out at this time of night, sometimes even a little later on a Friday night since I don't work Saturday morning, that's kind of among the reasons why I decided to kind of make this short, make this quit, kind of try to get things done, even as we have gotten them done now, and finally I say it's getting about my time to close up the video for the evening. It's going to probably be in my device a while. It might take it a while to maybe, let's say upload up to Amazon Photos to be downloaded and be uploaded to YouTube, but that's how the work has come along today, and I'll have a little more to share once I get a little bit more work put into place. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.